Kia ora koutou, no my haramai, welcome to Auntie's Buddy. Please, come in. Today we're going to make some kumara chips. He whakatauki, kaori te kumara e kori roana mō tōna aki rika. The kumara doesn't speak of its own sweetness. Let's remember to be humble, kind and not boast about how sweet we are. Let's let people find out that for themselves. Oh boy. Kia ora. I'm called Kumara. In the 13th century, we travelled with the Polynesian ancestors of Māori and the Waka to be planted when they reached to the shores of Aotearoa, New Zealand. And you're still doing the same thing that you were doing in the 13th century, feeding the whānau. Kau pai e koe. So making kumara chips is awfully simple. All you need is three kumara, bit of oil, a nice flat pan to put into the oven, a cutter to make your shapes or a knife, and some paper towels. Preheat your oven to 200 degrees. Bake or fan bake. Wash your kumaras with the skin on, then slice them into one centimetre thick. Lay the kumara slices onto paper or a clean tea towel and pat dry. Make shapes from the slices using the star shape cutter or a small knife. Place the shapes flat on the oven tray and lightly sprinkle or spray with oil. Cook in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes or golden brown. Add a little bit of salt if you wish and serve with your favourite sauce. Thank you for joining Auntie and her fuddy making kumara chips. I hope that you enjoyed it and learnt a little bit more about the kumara, the cool kumara. Until next time, kaki te anō.